one little switch makes such a difference. Okay. Be able to tell us how you led up to making this application. I've been thinking about um, coming to sort of this at work some time because a friend of mine at school was in for work. Um, and I've done a bit of sort of youth work and sort of thing. And uh, in that, you see so many kids, kids running through and really want to do something for them. But that, that was. Oh, and, and that's uh, a very fair decision. I'm putting light on them. Come 
in here a minute, mommy. Yeah, but, uh, Look, Kate. Yeah. Kate, come here. Come here. Come in, mommy. Come in, mommy. Mommy. Press the button, you must press Turn it on again. Come up the stairs. Can I just ask you, 
couple of questions about another place and that was in the psychiatric hospital where you yeah. worked on the mission for mm -hmm. um, am I right in thinking that you haven't had a great deal of contact with mental illness before going to that place for um, it's quite right um, mm -hmm. none at all certainly in adult mental illness mm -hmm. um, yeah, I was working with children and children's homes once or twice to help with children refer to uh, uh, a psychiatrist and mm. But the but kind of florid symptoms of yeah, mental yeah. illness you wouldn't have seen yeah, like really. Yeah. Manic depressive illness and yeah. um, schizophrenia. Yes. Okay. Well, as a result of that placement, what, what conclusions, if any, have you drawn about the nature of mental illness? The nature of mental illness? Um, mental illness affects uh, seems to affect individuals, whereas it, it may or may not be a manifestation of uh, perhaps a social condition or family, family difficulty. There's lots of things which may bring mental illness about, or at least bring about its diagnosis. Um, because it seems to me that uh, working on the ward, there are many people who um, perhaps suffered similar symptoms who were living in the community as those who were at the hospital. Yeah. Um, and there are many different reasons why people were admitted to the hospital, but most of them um, were well within the range of social workers in that they perhaps such a difficulty of isolation or the difficulties of uh, uh, an attractive family uh, which may uh, cause uh, a latent illness to click. I mean, there's another school of thought which says that mental illness is, is um, only defined by um, psychiatrists but then again, that doesn't exactly help the people who are obviously addicted. They're people with problems. Mm. Very much so. Okay. I take in a lot of things which perhaps others that I've worked with before have missed. Um, yeah, and so, you know, we have to. Look at things. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, could <laughs> I would be more prepared, I think, if it shows you what you need to prepare. Right? Yeah. Um, well, it's quite hard, it's hard. How did you feel? Do you want to facilitate? Like, um, right, perhaps we can see it, can we? Mm -hmm. yeah. I'd probably look uncomfortable, but it's in the <laughs> Oh, we're going to need another plug. Have you got another plug? Yeah, well, um, I've got another uh, plug, sorry. Might reach. Might reach. Yeah. Okay. Um, I think it's you know still my open ended question. Yes, it is. Yeah. I'm sorry, we'll be proud of you. Are you the same? Oh, it's still a hospital. It wants to be uh, rewind, isn't it? Oh, uh, yes, it does. Yeah. <laughs> I can also catch cameras.